Come here. Come here. So we make functional parts. That means you can build a part, take it out of the machine, and you can actually use it. It has so much potential because it, it is an additive manufacturing technique and uh, everybody's heard about 3D printing and sort of its rise. So this is a, you know, taking a step in that direction. It was exciting, it was educating. Two things I learned, I learned about metals, materials, and second and more important is I learned a lot about the machine. I, I understood a lot more things I could do with it or create with it. Can you pronounce your last name for me? Bandopathai. Okay. But Amit is fine. Okay. The whole world calls me Amit. Okay. And there is a reason for that. <laughs> <laughs> you actually did it perfect. Uh, Sushmita, it is exactly the way it is. Bose. It's just like Bose speaker. Sushmita, you know, she, we are husband and wife, and, you know, she comes from the background that I don't have, and I come from the background that she doesn't have, so we value each other's strengths. What we are doing with Aerojet Rocketdyne through this JCATI program is trying to make space component and trying to validate some ideas if we can actually do it or not. And this is not possible, right? So Essentially, it's a 3D printer of metals where you put in a powdered metal through argon transport. It deposits it uh, below a laser, which then melts it, and then it solidifies on a substrate that moves in the XY as it moves in the Z, so you can kind of build a part layer by layer. No. By doing that, and uh, being able to um, use different powders, we could possibly make a bimetallic part, which is something of interest for the aerospace industry where you could have like a, you know, some sort of tube, rod, or just any part that's stainless steel on one side, titanium on the other, and for various reasons that they might need that. Before this Jacati program, we mostly worked on materials for biomedical devices, but this program gave us an opportunity to find out some possible applications of materials and processing different advanced manufacturing techniques. You don't need the same part thousand times. You need the same part maybe 10 pieces a year, okay? So naturally, from cost perspective, it adds a lot of value if we can 3D print some of these parts. Not everything, but at least some of these parts. Then what you can do is you can produce on demands. Really, our Jacati program with Aerojet Rocketdyne is focused on space propulsion systems, some of the critical parts. Can we do 3D printing to make these things? Jacati, in this case, I think giving a new direction to our materials research, that has been very useful and fruitful, not only for our experience, but also the students' education and learning. Instead of me just doing something to get a grade and you know get the A, which is like a kind of short-term objective, and you know it's hard to it's hard to see the full picture when you know you join to be an engineer and then you have to go through all these classes repetitive. But now I'm doing work on the side that I actually feel like could make you know a difference. Guess what? You make this and we give it to them. Probably they're going to put it in a satellite. I said, all right, I'm doing this. <laughs> I want to be a part of that satellite. There's nothing like it when you really deal with the industry and look at the real life applications of the materials that you are making in your lab. It is very satisfying, not only to us, but also to the students. They see the real life practical applications of the materials. I love the project. It was challenging and rewarding. For us, we understand some aspects of research very well than others. Aerojet did not have that expertise, so they valued our expertise and they say, okay, can you work together? So by working together, what did we learn? I have never worked with any space industry. So by working with them, we understand the challenges that they have. You know, when I visited because of the JKIT program at Aerojet, there are a lot of things I learned and seeing there, I said, wow, okay, so I think we can 
or you can actually do here and things like that. This interaction, what it does, you know, essentially it's a relationship and I think it's, it happened because of Jakati.